people ask me, so where do I network? Where do I find networks where I can build solid, substantial relationships? And usually I ask them what you're looking for. Well, here, let, let, let's just look at different categories of networking opportunities, okay? You have the casual ones, which are people who might meet at a conference, public meetings, um, shopping, and it's great to always be friendly and to listen, um, make polite conversation perhaps, and just build some rapport. You may never see that person again, or you might make plans to meet that person again, or without planning, you might bump into that person again. Remember all of those things, and remember to have an elevator pitch, an elevator pitch that lasts not more than 90 seconds, so that people will remember you, remember you the right way. Um, special interest groups are great as well for networking. These may be people you share a hobby with. It could be sports, it could be volunteerism. And please, please, in your conversations, keep business out of it. Otherwise, people might label you as a vulture and not as a networker. Uh, build the relationships. Networking is never, never about selling. Later on, when people like you, they trust you, they know what you do, then they will come to you. Some online networks, of course, the most popular that we know of is Facebook. And it really, really is a wonderful resource because you have your personal page where you can share things about your personal self. Actually, it's also a good uh, research base. I know that people very often go to a person's personal profile and check out who are they, whom do they mix with, whom do they talk to, what's their background. So also be very careful when you po what you post because people are looking at your photos and your, your posts and things like that because it, it is public uh, even though it's your personal profile. Then of course a great way to build networks is to build pages which deal with only one particular area. For example, in addition to my profile page, I have three pages. One deals with business management, one deals with business resources, and another one deals with branding. And all of them are free. So people are quite happy to pop in there, browse around, pick up some tips, and maybe you know share some of their opinions, ask questions. And that's a great way of uh, networking and keeping people engaged. Strong contact groups will be uh, like say your work colleagues, people whom you see every day or people whom you share recreation time with. Do you play a sport every week or do you have a hobby that you engage in all the time? These are your strong contact groups and um, you never know. You, you never know you, who you can or cannot do business with because things are changing so fast. But if you build those relationships, then there you go. That's what it's about. That's how you are building your networks.